Okay, that was a lot. Welcome to One Message in the Bottle Tarot. My name is Awan and I am your spiritual advisor. Hello to all my beautiful messengers all around the world in your respective places. I appreciate you so very much for every single thing that you do. Number one, being a subscriber, uh, liking my video, sharing my content. Connecting with me in the comments because I love, love, <laughs> y'all be in the comments going crazy, all right? And I love it. I love to hear from you. So keep doing that, guys. Um, sending in your video requests, keeping it popping. Uh, okay, y'all yeah, kind of quiet, so I'm kind of having to come up with my stuff, but um, that's okay, too. But anyway, yes, all the comments, love, tips, and donations, um, everything you do to grow this channel and keep it moving forward. If you're new here, you're more than welcome to stay and join the gang. We definitely love to have you here. So subscribe if you like. Um, and give the kid a thumbs up. Hit the like button for me. Okay? Okay. <laughs> like, I barely, like, I... <sighs> Collective messengers. I, I just feel like we're just tired. It's tired of going through it uh, with whoever. Just like, we we over it. We done. Okay? So something definitely shifted i feel on this past uh strawberry moon if it was strawberry moon it tasted a little sour i ain't gonna lie i mean it, it started out sour but i feel like if you get a sour berry then you usually uh either go back into the box and you find one that's sweeter but if you bite another one you're like okay so this whole bunch is just trash and then maybe you buy another brand or maybe you move on or you know what i mean because it's like sour so why are you trying to make fetch happen <laughs> all right but anyway bittersweet all right it may have started out a certain kind of way but i feel like um some of you really did your best to kind of remain grounded and transmute that energy but i felt like you had to give it everything you had to like make this shit like okay go cool. you know i got this right but you do okay that being said, um, I'm hearing um, what they want to say to you. Okay, what they want to say to you. I see a lot what they want to say to you. But then directly after that, I heard, but who the fuck are they? Like, they want to say something to you, but who the fuck are they? I've been asking that for probably a good month, and I didn't even catch on, but it's been like a recurrent thing, like, and just different, uh, I don't know, wherever you want to apply that. You ever just say, like, who the fuck are you? You know what I mean? But who the fuck are you to do that, to say that, or to make that order, or to make that, like, I don't... Anyway, but yes, um, what do they want to say to you, but directly after that, but who the fuck are you? So I don't know if you care or not, uh, but that's what I heard. In that order, okay, but who the fuck are they? Like, who who is they? When somebody tells you something, you're like, okay, but who is they? Motherfucker, you know who they is, okay? Number one, uh, if it's you, all right, or if it's somebody dealing with you, they then you are the fucking they, okay? But who the fuck are you? Okay, so somebody has something to say. I don't know what side you fall on, but that's what I heard. Also... Oh, yes, look, they reminded me in that order. Okay, so this message is definitely for someone. Someone is in the hole. Um, I feel like financially, maybe it's a hard thing, uh, something to do with love relationships. And then I immediately saw, again, action and a uh, knight of wands energy. So, like, your dick literally puts you in the hole. So, I don't... 
Like, are you just in there realizing? And it's a little one too, but we gonna talk about that after the fact though. But yeah, somebody's behavior, sexual behavior, proclivities or whatever, just fucking has put them in the hole financially, like their literal dick. All right, that's on the side. So you know very well why you're there, fucking around with some bitches or doing something like that, respectively. Um, I, I don't know who you is, okay? That's not about some day, so I can't call you a divine uh, creature, uh, masculine, and I'm not going to call you a cormic. You know, again, we're asking who is they, so we'll get to that at the end if somebody remind me, all right? But, um... Somebody also has a big dick, uh, not big, oh, well, I guess somebody do. Okay, wait a minute, hold up, but move to the side. <laughs> first things first, somebody has a little dick, and you feel some type of way about this to the point of obsession. I'm honestly tired of talking about it. You still, I feel like you still uh, get ass or whatever, but it's, there's just this inadequacy, all right? Somebody also has trouble finding the hole or something like that. Like, I don't know if you... I don't know what's going on, but I feel like there's a machismo there, but you could really benefit from like some classes or calling a, 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 I'm hearing tantric something, guru, something like you ain't all, somebody's not all what they think they are, you know what I mean? And it's like, things could be a lot better if you weren't missing this and hitting that. I don't, I don't know. Okay. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why I need to even know this. All right. But I guess that's why I'm here because I'm the lady, but yes, yeah, your dick, like I'm tired of time. It's been like the fourth, fifth reading. I'm sure they have like enhancements or something like that. Or maybe it just doesn't work for you. I don't know. But you just need to just work with uh, God gave you. Uh, use your strengths. Yeah, that's what they said. Use your strengths. And I wouldn't even worry about that. Because if somebody loves you, which is what you want. I mean, I can make some kind of arrangement. Some. Okay. <laughs> like something. So it's not that. It is just what the fuck it is. If they don't have like uh the dick enlargement whatever i wouldn't even do none of that just like it is what the fuck it is work with your strengths and whatever that is uh move with that now oh, that real bitch ain't gonna she gonna make whatever out of whatever so it's like i mean i get it i don't get it because i'm not a nigga but i kind of am <laughs> no shade to me but i get it but it's just like yeah i just keep hearing work with your strengths okay i don't want to talk about this shit no fucking more okay um Moving on. So who is a collective? Um, what they want to say to you. So let's start there. I, I know this is a cycle. You said I sparked in the beginning. And this is also free. You are free of a cycle here. Look at the little bite. <laughs> uh, who said that? Who brought that energy earlier? I don't know. But... um. It was sis on Twitter, Instagram. Oh, yeah, always Elizabeth. I don't think I got that right in that order. It don't fucking matter. She knows the fucking talk too. Yes, bitch. <laughs> okay, exactly, motherfucking Elizabeth. All right, six of wands. Like, fuck some. I don't know. Somebody wants you to um go in a cycle uh with them, and you're just like it's above me now. <laughs> yeah, divine feminine. I can feel that energy. It's above me now, okay? Like, you have your own big dick energy. You carry your own big... You see how thick, fine... Like, you see this quaint... Like, somebody's not even in your level. This is a land. This is a clan. This is a tribe where women rule. You know what I mean? And that's what they fear. And that's what's going on um, with a lot of those agendas that are being uh enacted right now but go back for that but i'm just talking about yes divine feminine like here okay you are definitely free of a cycle here uh but yeah the sister was like it ain't about your weight your size or whatever any like i just told you uh fuck your dick size and it ain't about your thighs it ain't about your waist so it ain't about somebody wants you to like uh fucking like hamster wheel to fucking be like ain't nobody gonna do that shit <laughs> i ain't got to for what? Never had to. Never had to. Never will. I, you know what I mean? Like, I'm in a room because it's me. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Why would I? Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Real motherfuckers know who I am. Okay, so I feel like, yeah. Uh, well, let's start there. I feel like somebody six of wands energy. They know you're a winner. They know who you are. They know, but they try to like. 
gaslight you to make you think that you're not so you could so they could feel like they have some type of advantage over you but what everybody in the fucking room knows this motherfucker period this shit, period i for what you free yourself from some cycle like bitch i get in the room because it's me what the fuck you talking about and if I don't, then I don't because it's me and I'm me and I love me at the end of the day when you get through, son. <laughs> okay, in that order, son. So that's one thing I can say that you are in agreement with here. Collective is, you know, everybody know on the block, no, they know, you know, whether they hate and whether they love it, what, what, everybody know, period, <laughs> period. I feel like you had to be in a lot of asses spiritually to get where you are. All right. So what they want to say, you're number one, period. Okay. You're a winner. You recognize. They recognize. Bitch, you the hero. What the fuck you talking? It's a white horse. <laughs> it's a white horse. All right. You are also the hero of your own life here, period. Ain't about what nobody else think. Ain't nobody what anybody gotta give you fucking accolades as you, bitch. What they talking about? So who is they? Again, who is like who is <laughs> right in that order? Talking about uh what they wanna say to you, bitch. Who is they? Okay. Now, don't get me wrong, everybody is due respect where respect is due, but people act like like why wouldn't you be due respect? Because they said, like, who is they? Who? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like that's just the energy for the rest of the week. It's going to be a lot of that. It's going to be a lot of that. Okay. Uh, world prediction, right? J July 4th, 4th of July. Okay. That energy. Hence, it's going to be a lot of who is they. So I don't know what that means for whoever felt some type of way when I said it. Uh, but yeah, they're shaking the table. Okay. Something definitely. All right. No art Christ, Lord. I don't want none of that. I'm going to rebuke that right now. And at least come around me. Okay. Rebuke that. But no, shaking the table. Like you, like what you bring. Like what are you talking about? See this white horse? Okay. You see this focus? You see like, I'm, I am know who I am. You know who you are. You don't need nobody to put you on a fucking high horse. You don't need nobody fucking accolades. You got up on that bitch by yourself. All right? Like what? And somebody also needs you to come save a situation here. You're going to need to build up a fence to uh, keep your haters out. It's also a big hole in a fence somewhere. Uh, uh, somewhere. Map or wherever. It's a wall. Some uh, big some. A lot of them came through that bitch. But anyway, uh, yes. Okay, so they know you're number one. What else do they want to say? Uh, I don't think they matter. I don't think you care about I I really don't. I really don't. I feel like you beat niggas' ass, right? I feel like that reef is uh, his. Like, uh, but you too, you too kind, you too pretty with it. Like, everybody know. Like, if you was on some real, and that's how you make it look good. If you was on some real raw shit, you know, you might have a few bloody heads dripping down this stuff. But no, you got a little reef like you. All right, but people know. You won a lot of battles, okay? What else? What do they want to say? So knowing that, first things first, where are we at? Okay. You got a lot of boss energy here. All right, so you may have cut someone off, all right? This could be, uh, again, on this, uh, somebody feel like you're on a high horse. I guess so. I guess so. Especially if you're on your spiritual path. The hermit is when you go ghost and it's just like, let me just get my mind right. Let me just get, let me just, <laughs> period. Okay. So somebody may be wondering why you ghost them. Okay. Like why you don't, or why you block them? Why you don't fuck with them? Why you don't look at this shit? Watch this shit? Like, hey, I have shit to do. Like, I don't know. And then, uh, who, like, again, uh, who, 
I just keep hearing who was that or who was you. I don't know what's going on. It's so much crazy stuff. Yeah, what's that? And that's probably what it is. Need to stop looking at this damn timeline. All of us, all right? And get in the real winner circle. The real winner circle is when you put yourself first, when you do what you need to, whatever that means to you in whatever order, and not giving a fuck uh, about naysayers or the audience. Like, uh, it's your, like, it's you, okay? None of that shit matters here. And sometimes that means uh, taking space, taking uh, time away for yourself away from other people you might have some people that want an explanation for why you deal with them the way they well, it, like but who are you baby? Like, I just don't want to talk right now just want to do it right now just don't want to you know but I don't owe you nothing uh, on like you just above a lot of shit and then what do they have to say no one has anything I don't think they have anything to say and that's the point are you tired of listening and are not interested or not, you know just like nah I'm good on that and that's your right you know what I mean Herman Mo for something better on a path embracing your path here but somebody I feel like someone uh, is taking it personally here Look at you, Queen of Cups. This is all about you. Yes, Divine Feminine, come on through. Period. Okay, so Divine Feminine, uh, we know that, first of all. All right, they definitely, uh, this is what they want to say to you. Uh, also, why have you taken your cup back? Okay, why have you not interacting? You're not uh, whatever. Okay. I feel like uh, you're focused on bigger and better things. Winning! Shit. And uh, I know to win, I just got to... I just got to uh, block everybody out. A ain't nobody got anything to say uh, anyway. Anything that uh, anyone is offering is childish on some bullshit. Don't. Uh, just a lot of investment in childish people. Childish can led to nowhere. So I feel like, again, a divine feminine or even just collective uh, period um, here. You're just you're you're done and people that aren't. <sighs> able to meet you where you're at to you know give what you need and it's just like i'm not you know that kind of you can't really teach that kind of stuff and that's whatever it is to you i'm not talking about you know i i go above uh material and all like that's a given you know what i mean i'm talking about on that on the substance like what are they saying okay like what well, it's boring they bored they bored and they're boring okay so I, I don't know how you feeling but yes if that's the case okay so it's like if there is no substance and you're looking around it's like okay well this isn't here and you're complaining okay well bitch i guess i gotta be I, <laughs> the spark shit but i feel like people try to play you like you not and this is like i don't like why why would i sit around and entertain that fuck you mean you don't have to be here. I feel like people put themselves like, I ain't got to, you, why are you asking me why the fuck you don't have access to me anymore? You put yourself out there. Get thee behind me, Satan. That's my new motherfucking car. Get thee behind me, Satan. And that's where you put them. All right. I don't know why they trying to, uh, and then, then it's like, you trying to play with me about why, like, I ain't like, what for? Again, I also see that. You see how she got that one pinnacle around my neck? That I, I am enough. Shit. You are enough here. You got enough love for the both of you. Period. Again and again, you are the bag. Maybe they're realizing that after the sacrifice, after some prayer, after some enlightenment, you know, it's also giving you the one. Okay, first, let me, let me. Give you your uh, flowers, uh, so to speak, all right, after some thought, consideration, whatever. But I feel like they came to this conclusion after you uh, withdrew their access. I feel like they saw how much you invested in them, how much you put them on the path, so how much love you shown them, how much, you know, the attention, like, and you weren't getting the return on your investment, so you put that into yourself. And they feel some type of way. Yeah, beyond. Okay. Like I am over. I am done. Again, you are the spark. You're worth more than that. You're better than that. They know that now. 
I feel like the tables have turned where you used to, I mean, I feel like it, again, if you lose and sleep, it's because you're going through ascension, you working on your back, it, like, it's, you know, you figuring out how to love, like, bitch, I know why I'm not sleeping, <laughs> I know, okay, it ain't for, it ain't, but it ain't over you, it ain't over you, what you talking about, who's, like, you don't want to hear it anymore. And I feel like uh, you're working that out and somebody can see you uh, doing that work here, even through the pain, even through the hurt, even through all of that. And then somebody is also like uh, beside themselves because you walked away from them. Because you like they like you are the bad. We, how do you fumble? They fumble when you like this. OK, they know they fumble. They know. It's like, damn, why do that? Why do that? I feel like when you was in it trying to convince and all of that, maybe you was beside yourself. Now it was in reverse, but not no more. You're some. You're so beautiful. You're so fucking amazing. Like, uh. And now they want to uh, come clean it up like they the answer. But look, get the where you at behind. Like, okay, you smarter than whatever. Uh. Uh, whoever like I don't know it's like they want to come like they the answer but you were the answer uh, all along here alright talking particularly to my divine feminines I feel like bitch you got enough money, uh, enough money essence all of that to feed all uh, like uh, feed all of them and the bitches that uh, they left you with or played you with or, or whatever I feel like some bitches also gonna get cut though too. So somebody gonna come to their senses. She like you ain't bringing that mess over here. Four ones. Everything is fine. Some divorce, marriage, contract, home situation is it is not fine. It's not okay. Well, what somebody is doing in regards to a house is not fucking uh okay. Uh so somebody may want to talk about some paperwork or And, I, and I'm tired of talking about this couple. I don't know who this is. I, I, <laughs> and I feel like that's exactly why you don't hang around these people. Because of their immaturity here. There's a couple out, here, couple out here that cheated all through their damn marriage. Even had people all up and through the house. I don't know if that was y'all agreement. I feel like y'all went way beyond uh, whatever agreement y'all had. But is either a nigga bringing bitches and fucking in his marital home. Or the bitch bringing uh, bitches and niggas in the marital home. Or all of the above here. All while this person probably knew they had a divine feminine. So somebody uh, definitely cheated on their divine feminine. I don't know if you married a karmic or what was going on here. But someone is freeing themselves of a cycle. Like why would I Why would I sign up for that? Why would I do that? I feel like what you want to say to them... Uh, I feel like after separ separating from someone, uh, someone they're gonna come back like with the offer, and all you're gonna have for this person is 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 the receipts. Uh, everything that they showed you was better than you. You know what I mean? <laughs> well, let's see. You had this bitch, okay? And somebody else, I got the package, but ain't none of my business. Um. I don't think uh, it's, it's like, why would I entertain to have this conversation? I feel like uh, there's divine math. You want another chance. You want all this, 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 and this, but somebody is over. They're done proving their worth. I'm not going to prove my worth. I'm not going to fight with you and these other bitches or whatever you want to do. Okay, fine. Do that. Okay. Or whoever this is in their respective uh, place here. Yeah. I ain't no fool what I look like. You're done. 
You're done. I don't want to go on no adventure. Try to figure out how I can tip. Like I'm not. You're not interested in none of that shit. And that's what also makes you a winner. That's what also makes you dope. And the day you walked away, and the day you just uh, got on your journey and got on your shit, is the whole day they realize like, damn, I really, really fumbled. And I feel like you've been showing and proving. And now they want to come back after they and you know, I guess cleaned up their mess. But like, look at all these fucking sores. Like once or whatever, it's still gonna be like uh, that. Like nah. Like, uh, there's, there's nothing to talk about here. Yeah, you your own boss. All right. Finally here, this empress energy here. Somebody's realizing they fumbled their empress. All right. I don't know when they, uh, uh met you or didn't give you time to grow or whatever, but now you just beautiful. I mean, look. Okay. On the journey where you end up. Okay. They want to say they sorry, but I don't know if it, I, you busy, bitch. You busy. She's like, shit, what am I going to argue for? I can just pour what I was pouring over in his cup and pour it in my cup. And look at all the green, the, the grass is green where my, where I'm at, bitch. Shit. If you ain't thirsty for me, bitch, I'm thirsty for me. <laughs> Period. I'm the shit. And what I do is the shit. Period. Period. And whether you want or not on, it don't change who the fuck I am. You may, yeah, you're the dummy afterwards. Somebody judge a book by its cover. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know who raised them. <laughs> yeah. You know, maybe they want to tell you this. And somebody want to run the block. I feel like you done. I ain't finna ride no bike, ride to the park, ride no cycle. Like none of that shit. Whatever. Somebody said running in place. They running in place. Trying to figure out how they going to whatever. Let's close this out. Give me an oracle. Inner fucking peace. <laughs> oh, be here now. That's what you are. You're being there for yourself. Uh, come on, inner peace. I don't have all day. Okay? Like, I... Like, who has time? You don't. But that's what they want to say. Okay, but again, who the fuck are they? Not, nothing. You got this. Been had this. You don't need nobody to validate you. Say you this or what you can't. Like, none of that. I don't need I don't need your nothing, nigga. God told me who I was from the day, you know, and I told you too. And if, like, I, okay, cool. Like, be, like, done. I feel like you're done. And I'm proud of you. It's like, get yourself. <laughs> yes. Okay. Period. <laughs> all right i love that for us do me a favor like this video okay if you haven't already go ahead and subscribe tap in book a personal below okay so we can talk about you all right also tip the bartender you can do that cash app or paypal um uh, all the information is in the bio baby okay leave your comments let me know how you feel all of that I love you so much, okay? Because you're the bomb, all right? I don't know who the fuck they is, but you're the bomb. I do know that, all right? And I know I love you with the highest love. One.